everybody. Now this video will show you how to recover lost data from Hitachi hard drives with single head damage or weak heads. Due to the single head damage or weak heads, the hard drive ID information may not be read or the firmware error is not accessible. So how to fi fix such kind of single head damaged laptop hard drive? So we need to use one function. It's called edit NVRAM head map. Now we need to enter the Hitachi firmware repair software, firmware op operations. Now edit NVRAM. Because this, head, this hard drive has the head 1 is very weak. So we need to change the head 1 to head 0. Change the head map here in the NVRAM. OK, click OK. Now we create the program, power off, power on. Now the drive has the head 1 disabled. So the only remaining heads are head 0, head 2, and head 3, because this drive has 4 heads. Now we just wait until the drive gets ready. So after the drive gets ready, we can go to the DFL DDP data recovery tool to use selective head image to get the data without head swap. Anyway, if you want to do 100% data recovery, you need to swap the heads and then use the selective head image. Now the drive gets ready. After we disable the head one, now we can try to get the hard drive ID. See, it's very successful. Now we can go to the DFL DDP data recovery module. We need to go to the DDP installation folder and open. Yes, Archive. So here. We enter the DDP data recovery on the SATA 0, and this is also on SATA 0, but we occupy the channel. Now we go to set up one new project, set imaging project, new imaging project. Next step, disk image. Next step, image to file. We can see disk image, hit patch, ARM. Okay. Click fish. Now we enter this imaging interface. We need to set up the head map. Attach ARM. Okay, so now the program starts to set up the head map. At this time, we, we need to wait until the head map is being set up. For this unstable hard drive, the head map can be a little slower than normal working hard drive. So we need to wait until the head map completes. Then we can use selective head imaging technologies to image the good heads first and then image the bad heads. Usually, after we image the good heads, it's always suggested to swap the heads and then image the bad heads, imaging the remained unimaged heads. So this one is very safe for 100% data recovery. Now we are setting up the head map. We need to wait. So just wait. You just can see this is one new hard drive. I mean the model. New series hard drive 5475A9. So it belongs to the ARM new Hitachi hard drive. So it's very common for this kind of hard drives have single head thinner or very weak heads. Sometimes translator damage too. So we need to try to edit the head map in NVRAM first to get the drive ready. Because sometimes when the head is damaged, the drive cannot get ready. It's busy. So you need to edit the NVRAM within the Hitachi firmware operations menu. Here, edit NVRAM. 
because we have worked on the drive here, so you cannot work on here at the same time. Okay, we need to stop here and then switch to the Hitachi firmware repair program. Then we can operate on the Hitachi hard drive to add MVRAM. Now let's wait until the map completes. This hard drive has very unstable head on head 0 and head 1. Head 0 is better than head 1. So when we use the selective head image, we can image head 2 and head 3 first, and then head 0. Finally, swap head and image the head 1. This is the suggested process. It's now 80% to set up the head map. So the head map is going to be completed very soon.
for data recovery, users need to be patient, not just to click very fast. That may destroy your hard drive if you click too fast. Okay, now, from the logs, we can see this drive has four heads. However, users don't forget the head one has been disabled in the MVRAM. So here, we need to untick the head one. Because the head zero is also very weak, so we, we can image only head two and head three first, and then we go back to image head zero, and then swap head to image head one. So this one is the suggested process. Now let's check if it's good situation to image only head 2 and head 3. So users can find it's very fast to, to image the head 2 and head 3. So whenever users get the drives which are busy, which are very slow, which are not detected, users can try to edit head map in MVRAM in the Hitach firmware repair program, the edit MVRAM. Okay? So this is the right process to recover such kind of hard drives. Thank you for watching this video.